Hi there, my name's Mike. First of all, I'd like to say well done for choosing this particular course in helping find the best employment for you. I'm going to be your English teacher on this course and I hope to guide you through a number of important steps which will help to reduce the stress in finding suitable employment in the English speaking world and give you the confidence to go from strength to strength. Throughout the course we're going to look at some vocabulary. There may be some words, phrases or even expressions which are unfamiliar to you, commonly known as colloquial words or everyday vocabulary. These words will be highlighted in red and will help you build your vocabulary. In lesson one we will look at the ways and methods of how to get you started on your career path. So we'll look at where to start, the types of recruitment sources available and which one is best for you. Lesson 7 is all about application forms. Getting it right first time. So what do all the boxes mean? We'll look at equal opportunities and we'll look at monitoring or diversity forms. Lesson 8 is covering letters. So we'll look at what to say in a covering letter. Does the layout matter? And how long should it be? Lesson 9 consists of speculative letters. So, what are speculative letters? Where to source suitable companies? And what should I say in the letter? Lesson 10, this is the crux of the course really, it's all about interview skills. The most important part probably, you're actually there in person. Part one, attending the interview in person. Being confronted by an interview panel. Not just one, two, three, four people maybe. And what to say and what not to say in the interview. And lesson 11 is about the second part of the interview skills. We'll look at the steps in this video will all be about helping to eliminate the majority of the pitfalls that many interviewees are often faced with at this final stage. Lesson 12 will look at the conducting a telephone interview. If you're applying for a job in another country, it's important for the employer to eliminate, to dispense with, if you like, any doubts or queries regarding your search for employment. And they will do this by a screening process. The employer has read your details, but before he or she invites you for an interview, they want to clarify one or two points about you. And that's called screening. Therefore, you have to be ready, prepared for detailed questioning. So you've got to be positive, you've got to be precise, and you've got to be confident. Lesson 13 is actually the last lesson. Now this is the conclusion to the whole course. In this lesson, we will be revising specific vocabulary, phrases and expressions used throughout each lesson. That's what we talked about at the beginning. So we're going to conclude like that. When seeking employment, job hunting, looking for work, whatever you want to call it, you will experience the highs and the lows. Therefore, it's important that you persevere with your search for that perfect job. This course will prepare you to succeed. But it's important to remember one thing. Never, never, never give up. So good luck, because this course may change your life forever.